Hello everyone, Machi here, welcome back to another episode of Team Building and in this episode we're gonna take a look at uh, fully uh, ranged, uh, ranged based attacks uh, team Maria9 and Irvine now uh, this team uh, has a lot of synergies going on and uh, it, it kinda has immediately uh, a few things uh, pretty much very noticeable right away which is um, of course it is a team that um, it's kind of built around the Irvine debuff the range resist down debuff and you start from there uh, everyone in our team will hit for weakness of course there are a ton of ranged characters so uh, there are a lot of possibilities to build, to build around the Irvine in that uh, in that regard um, but in our case here we have nine and Maria so but uh, all uh, of, our, of our characters here, 9, Irvine and Maria, heals as well. So we have a ton of healing, uh, but that's not really the point. Uh, the point is having a, uh, a lot of, uh, first of all, overflow that Irvine provides, uh, 9-2 to an extent, uh, to the whole team, uh, the fully uh, range-based team, uh, and that's because uh, you know, we will do. Uh, we will try to do as much damage as possible with nine uh, um, primordial roar to get uh, as much shield as possible. So having a, a lot of overflow helps with the shield uh, as well. Uh, the more damage you do, the bigger the shield for, uh, from nine. So uh, having that one is really useful. Maria provides also physical attack, and all of our characters here are based. Uh, you know, are physical attackers. So uh, she provides uh, even more kind of attack boost to everyone. Nine, uh, of course, provides uh, a ton of uh, safety, uh, bar stealing with the EX, uh, very, very good AOE damage. And uh, um, overall, uh, I guess he will be kind of our main uh, uh, heavy hitter as well. Uh, while Irvine and Maria provides the support, uh, really. Irvine enabling the others to do more damage and also putting uh, some nice speed down on the enemy, while Maria providing uh, a little bit more battery to the team and the physical attack up, like we said, and also, uh, and also the healing and uh, the sap from the from Ariex, which is uh, a nice... Uh, a nice uh, little bit of bravery back to gain so overall I, I would say a pretty balanced team uh, while still keeping three range characters together so we have kind of a pseudo tank in nine uh, healing uh, but good damage good AOE damage overall from all these characters as well so pretty balanced out team uh, while keeping that range team uh, going on uh, so not too offensive um, I would say more defensive than offensive definitely with this team but pretty balanced overall so let's try let's try it out we're gonna use brothers as our summon and we are doing the machina lost chapter chaos fight here all right we have the first wave to go through first start with primordial roll we get a nice 50k shield right away which is pretty pretty nice Maria proper shot for battery and uh, higher turn rate. Okay, let's try a high jump plus with 9. See how much we do. 74k right away from pretty very low bravery, so not bad. Okay. And I think I'm gonna use an arrow rain right away too. Uh, just because I just want to do uh, AoE. Irvine, we need, you need your max brave up, so scatter shot. We cannot put speed down on these two enemies. Alright, let's continue with just spamming skills for now. Try to do as much AoE damage as possible as well. This is another canister shot. Oh, 
Yeah, we're hitting very, very hard with uh, nines HP plus here with uh, with damage applied. All right, armor shot from Irvine. Let's refresh our range resist down. And do some nice damage. Alright, and now we have the uh, sub from Explode, uh, Exploding Arrow, giving us some nice, decent uh, bravery overall. Of course, it's even more when there are like three enemies, you can gain a lot out of that. Our shield is still pretty healthy with nine. Okay, we have a free skill from, uh, from Maria here. Let's use proper shot. And yeah, I don't really have the need to uh, spam skills with nine for now, so I'm just gonna go very, very uh, chill and HP plus since we are doing a ton of damage with that one anyway. Needle shot, double needle shot on Irvine, but we don't really have healing problems here with this team. Alright, Maria, let's use your HP plus 2 for some nice battery to 9. Ah, yeah, one more HP plus with 9. I still have to use my LD with 9. I'm probably gonna use it just on the second wave. I don't think there's. That, you know, it's not uh, too needed to use it now on this wave, I think. And now the EX from 9 will hit, I think, pretty much always max damage as possible, even on two targets. So, pretty good stuff there. Alright, let's use one more arrow rain. One more scatter shot. Oh, sorry, uh, canister shot. We will need to refresh our shield as well. Not right away. I don't think there's no need to do that right away. Let's proc our LD with 9. Since we are almost at the second wave. Here we go. Alright. Let's go primal roll right away. Scatter shot. We have exploding arrow, perfect. Or explosive blow. Expo explosive blow, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Let's use high jump. Again, very decent damage. Just with HP plus from 9. Active cannon is a little bit annoying because we will take more damage that way and our shield is gonna pop sooner, so. Need to be careful with our shield. Let's use one Whirling Lance. For easy max damage there too. Proper shot. Unfortunately, these two enemies are uh, immune to speed down, but it's pretty useful to speed speed down from uh, from uh, Irvine, of course. We will do max damage with our EX here too. We are almost out of shields already, so they are doing a lot of damage actually. Uh, let's just use an HP plus with Maria just to battery more. Of course, having uh, the weakness damage on the HP plus of Maria allows us to battery the party for a lot more as well. So that's always nice too. Let's use a debuff 
an AA from uh, from Irvine as well, just to proc the damage there, and another canister shot. Bullet Omega, which is an HP attack, will not do much because we have the protection from uh, uh, 9LD as well. Let's just use another high jump. Let's use another primal roar. This one won't be as strong as the other one because we started from lower bravery kind of. These enemies are also pretty fast, so we cannot keep the weakness, uh, the range resist down all the time. But pretty often, I guess. We can keep that one up. And we don't have a particularly fast team, uh, really. It, this one did a, li a little bit of damage. And our shield is down already, so they are starting to do some decent chunk of damage here. Explosive bow, very much needed right now. Let's put the sap on. And. Let's just HP plus with Irvine. Okay, Arrow Rain. Let's heal back up. And before we use Laser Lance, I think I'm gonna proc another shield, another Primal Roar. We don't have any uh, high defense with this team as well, so um, so the shield is not going like it's not gonna last that much. Even if we, if we get very high in value, uh, the bosses will probably start to uh, start to do uh, a lot of damage to it. All right, let's use laser lance now. They are doing a lot of, of, of damage overall, I would say. That's a nice HP pass for Maria. Um, let's just use another AA with Irvine to dump Bravery and then another Scatter Shot. And uh, high jump. We don't need to, to do much more there. Proper shot. Let's battery the others a little bit, as much as we can. Maria almost down with the shield there. Nice miss here. Armor shot is ready, very much needed right now as well. So I was almost uh, dropping the uh, EX buff from Mirvine there, which is crucial as well. Okay. Let's use about 1 AA with. with 9 and another White Knight. And then we can probably just um, let's use Whirling Glance. We're starting to get a real tanky now. The the bosses here too. 
Good damage there from Maria ZX. Still hitting pretty hard. Tempest Bolt is an HP attack. We just procced our uh, LD with 9. And let's use one more Primal Roar. Fresh our shields. Just station plus here, right? And Laser Lance on A. No longer max damage with Bravery there, as you saw, but still very, very high damage. Also, are getting tankier. All right, let's use one arrow rain with Maria here. And canister shot with Irvine. One more boost thrust. And willing glance. Down, actually down on Irvine. Proper shot. Um, probably I need to scatter shot again as well. And I think I probably need to use White Knight right away again. I think. Uh, I mean, I don't need to, but I'll probably do it. We still have two uses of it. The bosses are going down faster than I thought, definitely. We have a launch there too, uh, let's just high jump on A. Okay, that's a lot of bravery on uh, B. Let's see if we can shave it a little bit. The answer is yes. Irvine, of course, is taking more damage here because he has the weakness applied. Uh, I believe 9 still has the um, White Knight ability, so we can actually. Um, can kind of tank uh, a hit here too but anyway uh, I'll do a primal roar anyway we don't have any more AAs because I want to refresh the shield on Irvine too and Irvine can now just use the armor shot which is still hitting like a truck so very good from Irvine here Procked our LD there with 9-2. I'm probably gonna use one more LD, I guess. And we can also use an arrow rain. Laser lens, let's do it on B. This one should hit very hard too. Nice. Electric cannon on Irvine again. He's bad man. And I know I didn't summon. Uh, I guess the bosses just went down so fast that I really didn't need. <laughs> really didn't feel the need to summon. But let's do it. let's use it now for the last bit of health there. Let's also use an AA from Maria. Let's 
Let's use White Knight too, just for good measure, just to get a ton of bravery. Wow, double kill, okay. Good! <laughs> that was fast. Wow. Alright. So, uh, I hope you guys had a good uh, kind of idea on how this team works. Um, I think there are a lot of variations that you can do with both Irvine and Nine. Uh, because, uh, well, Irvine, of course, needs ranged, uh, ranged um, kind of allies with him. Nine is very versatile as a character, too. And Maria uh, prefers, of course, physical attackers uh, as, te as teammates. And we kind of synergized all of those uh, kind of qualities together in this team. Uh, still good damage, uh, AoE damage, uh, like you saw, and good protection overall, and a ton of healing as well from everyone. So, hope you guys had a good uh, kind of idea of how this thing can work. Let me know what you guys think in the comment, and see you guys soon on the next videos.